We begin with a police shooting in Essex. It is breaking news that we have been following on air and as we stream here on WMAR 2 News at 6. I'm Jamie Costello. And I'm Kelly Swoop. WMAR 2 News is Dave Detling live near the scene. Dave, what can you tell us? What have you found out so far? Jamie Kelly, we are in the 900 block of Boundbrook Way. Like you said, this is in Essex and police are on scene investigating a fatal officer involved shooting. Let me step out of the way. You can see uh, they are particularly around this house that where this investigation uh, is. We are waiting for the AG's office to arrive. That is the standard protocol when there is an officer involved shooting. Also on scene, Baltimore County. And what we are hearing from sources is that Baltimore County Police first came to this home because of a 911 call believed to be domestic uh, related. Uh, unclear exactly what led to this shooting, but neighbors telling us they heard possibly three shots. I did speak to the deceased family member, the sister. Uh, she said that her brother, a 40 year old, is dead. Uh, we are waiting for more information from Baltimore County Police. We are expecting an update within the next 30 minutes. Of course, we will bring you the very latest as it becomes available. We're live in Essex tonight. Dave Detley, WMAR 2 News. Well, this is the second police involved shooting involving Baltimore County officers in less than a month. April 14th, officers shot a 19 year old who attempted to ram them with a car near Maryland Avenue and Avon Beach Road in Dundalk. The officers were attempting to arrest two people suspected in the murder of Rosario Valente when it happened. Four officers fired at the car, hitting the driver. And then on Monday, a grand jury ruled that shooting justified.